chair will never be the same. What up guys, my name is Kate and on this episode of Take My Money, we are gonna review the Little Green Pet Pro Bissell. This is a revamp to the Little Green Machine, which we absolutely love. Click below to see that video. Let's try it out. While unboxing this machine, I can see it comes with three different nozzles. It comes with a bigger nozzle, which was probably for more plush carpets, a slightly smaller nozzle, which is for maybe less thick of carpet, a thinner kind of texture material. Lastly, it comes with this thinner nozzle, which is probably for more hard to reach areas. To start using your machine, you wanna fill up the tank with water and make sure to fill it up to the water line and then add two fluid ounces of the cleaning solution. Each bottle is eight ounces and it takes two ounces to fill up the tank. So you get around four uses for each bottle. You can rebuy bottles online. Of course, I wish there were more uses out of one bottle. However, there's so much water in the tank that you can use this on many, many surfaces. You can use it on all the carpets in your house, your couches, your grout, and you probably would still have water left over. I noticed that the hose itself isn't extremely long, but the cord on the machine is very long. So if the area you're cleaning is far from the machine, the cord hopefully will be long enough for you to reach it. Once you've filled up your water tank, you're ready to go. Start by clicking the red button on your machine and then the suction power will begin. The machine is loud. Here is what it sounds like. So you can tell it's extremely loud and the suctioning is pretty strong. So be careful. This is the stain we're gonna work with today. It is a white chair with kind of water stains on it. I love this chair. It's been through a lot. I got it for free. So I never really cleaned it deeply and I really need to. I'm gonna use the bigger nozzle for this chair. Then I'm gonna click the green button on the machine and it will put out the water. I'm just going to kind of wet the stains first. I'm not gonna suction it up yet. Once I've wet it a bit, then I'm gonna brush over it with the suctioning. And I'm also gonna continue to spray some water with the suctioning. So really trying to lift up the stain. Once I felt like the stain was lifted up, I stopped spraying the water and I just slowly suctioned up the excess water. And as I suctioned up the excess water, I was suctioning up the water, but also the dirt that was then lifted up. The seat before had these blotches of stains that have been there for years, and now the stains are completely gone. If you're buying a piece of furniture or rug from someone else and you really want to deep clean, I highly recommend using this machine before you even start using that item. I wanted to try this device on grout. I tried the nozzle that was more thin. That doesn't really work on grout. I wouldn't recommend it. It's really more for in-between cushions and stuff. I then used a smaller head for the grout, and I found that it worked really well. On this channel, we tried a different Bissell device on grout. You you can see that video via the link below. If a pet were to have an accident, I think this machine would be great for it because the solution makes it feel like you're really sterilizing the space in general. Grout, it really sucks up water well. If you spill something, maybe coffee on your tile floor, but then not only that, it feels like it's sanitizing it at the same time. When you're done with your machine, all you need to do is dump out the dirty water and wipe away any excess debris on the red filter. Overall, after using this machine, I am super happy with it. I give it a hundred out of a hundred on the pure all rating. I think it's great. It does its job. The only cons I have, it's so much water that's left in it that I feel like I'm wasting product because I had to pour some of the water out. But other than that, it did great job. Comment below what you think of it. If you've ever tried it, remember to like subscribe, turn on those post notifications, and we'll see you next time.